So what I'm going to show you guys right now is how you can use the HDMI cable with your uh, Xperia Arc on this device. All you have to do is plug in your uh, HDMI cable, HDMI micro, into your HDI, HDMI uh, TV. Um, as soon as you do this, what it's going to do is first turn on your TV for you, when, so you don't have to touch anything on the device or on the TV. All you're doing is connecting the cable. It takes a bit to boot up on the TV, but because it's on the... Uh, TV's got to wake up. <coughs> well, you'll notice right on the top is it's going to say cell phone on the top there. And on your device, what's going to happen is it's going to go right to your gallery mode and you're going to get the same thing on the television as well. Now, this will work with all uh, most HDMI TVs. Um, the great thing is I don't, I don't have the remote with me right now, but if you, if you have a Bravia TV with Bravia Sync, what you can actually use is now your TV remote to control all, all of the information on your gallery. So imagine just having this phone plugged into your TV, sitting back down on the couch, grabbing your remote control, and going through your family vacations photos as well as the videos. Now if you want to see a couple pictures, we can go in through here, and this is the photo quality that you're going to get. Just got to load up a bit. And here you can see a very, very good quality photo at 8 megapixels. You can also pinch to zoom and navigate through this way as well. Video as well, you're looking at full 720p video quality, uh, shooting and output as well. This is an example of Final Fantasy. Now not only that though, but you can also not just watch video, but go back to your main menu screen here and interact with the device all on your TV as well. So I can still listen to my music and still go through my photos on the device as well. So even if you wanted to, you can also go on your web browser jump on the internet and start surfing the internet on your TV off your device. And you can actually use your TV remote to control the web browser as well.